Hey guys! Hello, hello! How are you? How are you? How are you? I'm just getting my Facebook up. It's taking a second. Here it goes. See, have anybody in yet? Oh wow! Hi guys! Hi Sylvia! Hi Eileen! Hi Gina! I it doesn't show me everybody that's watching, so I'm sorry. I'm not intentionally ignoring you. Um, I am just trying to get this pin post in. Hi, Barb. Hi, Norma. Oh, hi, Tammy. Okay, so we got it in. Hi, Jen. How are you? Um, hi, Roberta. Hi, Brandy. How are you guys? So tonight, I am going to be doing part two of my Table to Soul project. Um, I did the bottom part of this. It's going to be a two-piece board um, for my dining room. I did it in my dining room colors. Um, hi, Norma. So, hi, Kimberly. How are you? Um, I did this last night on YouTube Live. So, um, I said I was going to finish the next part, you know, today. So, hi, Aunt Renee. Um, hi, Tammy. How are you? So, um, I wanted to do the upper part tonight on Facebook Live because I've been trying to do more YouTube Lives. So um, if you guys, hi Jen, hi Heidi, hi Jenny. If you guys don't follow me on YouTube, um, it's Crafting and Stampin', which I will put in the comments down below. But um, I've been trying to do a little more of that um, just to kind of like spread it out a little bit, you know? So um, I did the first part last night and now I'm gonna do the second part tonight. Oh no, we have a situation. Hold on, I may have to adjust this. Oh my goodness gracious me, it's a little too big. But that's okay, we're gonna, we're gonna make do. We're gonna totally make do with this. We're gonna just cut out the swirly part of this F. That's all. Hi Luann, hi Johnny, hi Stacy. hi Lourdes, hi Lisa. Thanks for joining, guys. As you're coming in, be sure to share. Um, yeah, we're going to have to cut out the curly cue here. And I'll just have to adjust it. But, um, yeah, so anyway, I did this, um, the first part last night. And now I want to finish it. And I am going to hopefully be able to get it to line up pretty good. The biggest part I have to line up is the table. The part that says table, which there we goes. I think I got it there. I just got a slew of bubbles is all. And I just got to fix the bubbles. But um, yeah, I love this transfer. I'm super excited to hang it up. And I specifically wanted to have it done before everybody came over tomorrow for little Brand's birthday. Just because I think it's a fun transfer. It really is. And it is a gigantic beast. I will tell you that much. Um... And like I said, I'm already able to tell you that it is so big, it does not fit all the way on the board. But that's okay. We're going to make do. Hi, Yvonne. Hi, Christina. Hi, Sharon. Hi, Jessica. How And hi, Monique. How are you guys? Um, so wait, let me get the... I know what I... I always am forgetting because I've been trying to be super diligent about charging my light. Forgot to get my light on. There it goes. Hopefully that gives us some more lighting and then hopefully this is straight there it goes okay so yes got a slew of bubbles let's work out the top part bubbles first and then we'll work it down so how's everybody doing today it's friday we got bubbles okay got lots of bubbles i think what i have to do is lift this up 
goes. Hi, Debbie. Hi, Sharon. Hi, I'm Mandy. How are you? And I gotta lift up a little more. Get the air out. Just gotta make sure there's no bubbles in the silk screen. And believe me, I can tell the second I have a bubble when I don't see it and I'm putting the chalk paste down, you hear it. And it's not fun. There it goes. Hopefully that worked out better. There we go. I think we're better now. Much better. Oh, wait, no, that E is not a happy E here. There it goes. Okay, so we're going to make do with the area. Come on, chicken. There's your bubble. That bee's got one. All right, we're going to do our best. And hopefully they're all gone. Why is that one not leaving? There we go. Okay, I, I really think I'm good this time. <laughs> I know I kept saying it, but I think I'm really good now. Okay, so... How I did it was, I know, Debbie, we're supposed to be getting a two tomorrow. Hi, Nikki. Hi, Heather. Hi, Rhea. Hi, Steph. Hi, Joanne. Yeah, we're supposed to be getting the snow tomorrow, and I'm not excited about it. Hi, Nancy. I'm like, really? Like, it's April. Can we, can we, can we quit it with the snow? Like, who did, who upset Mother Nature so much to have this happen? That's what I want to know. <laughs> okay. So finally, chalk time. Yay, 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 yay. Okay, so I did the words in yellow. The two is going to be in aquamarine. And then the little, little rooster is going to be in red. So that's how we're going to do it. Hi, Tammy. Hi, Yvette. Hi, Patty. Oh, very, very good, Hava. The big squeegee, yes. Oh, look, at there's more. Let's see if, that, if that'll work for me. I think because of the way that I have this, yeah, I, it, they're not gonna, they're not moving. There's a few that just are stubborn here. And I think it's because of the way I had to lay this out that I'm gonna kind of just be forced to deal with some of them. But just, it's, it's not the end of the world. I'm really okay with it. I'm okay with a vintage type of look, you know? Wasn't me, LOL. <laughs> what wasn't you, Heidi? Oh. Alrighty, so are we ready? So here's what I'm going to do tonight. I am going to work my way down, okay? I'm going to get my chalk paste ready, and I'm going to work my way down. So I'll start with the yellow, go to the red and the aquamarine, and then go back to yellow. And then as I'm doing it, I'm going to lift them. I'm going to do the lift and pull method, okay? Hi, Debbie. How are you? I know, Heather. Girl, that's my life. I can always hear the bubbles the second... I start spreading the paste on. I'm like, oh, I hear it. I hear it. I hear it. It's so annoying. Hi, Megan. How are you? Thanks for joining. Hello, Debbie. And as you guys are coming in, please be sure to share my video. Bottom left-hand side of your mobile device is a share button. Oh, Heidi. I, exactly. It wasn't you. Ah, I get it now. Yes. You didn't send it to me, huh? And you didn't upset Mother Nature, right? <laughs> Yeah, someone did. I'd like to know who did because um, I'm I'm pretty bummed about it. I, I I need I need Mother Nature to back off with the snow. It's it's enough is enough now. I I can't take it anymore. I'm I'm over it. Okay, I'm ready. Are we got guys, guys? Are we ready? Yay! Hi, Jan. Um, so if you guys have no idea what I'm doing and I just rambled for uh 15 minutes. <laughs> This is Chalk Couture. We sell silk screen adhesive back reusable transfers. You can reuse our transfers over and over and over again. Um, we also sell chalk paste. It's, our chalk paste is super cool. Goes on wet, dries hard, and you can spray it right off. If you make any mistakes, it'll come off with water. But you can also seal it to make it permanent. Hey, Cindy, how are you, girlfriend? So um, tonight I'm going to finish up, like I said, um, I'll hold up the, the sign I did last night. It's the bottom half of it. Um... And I will show you as soon as I'm done that because I don't want to risk putting anything up on this table that'll give any more bubbles. So it was me. I can never get enough snow. Oh, girl. We saw three feet. Heidi. Oh, no. Bite your tongue. Hi, Maria. How are you? 
So, okay guys, we're ready to go, so let's do this. I'm just gonna come in and be a little sloppy. And I also want to give a little shout out. I had someone message me and tell me that their her little girl loves watching Messy Jessie. So Messy Jessie's gonna be full effect tonight. And I believe my little girlfriend's name um, is Kaylee. And hopefully I did not butcher the name or say the name incorrectly. But Kaylee, thank you very much for watching me, girlfriend. I hope you're having fun doing Chocolate Tour with your mom. So I just wanted to make sure I gave that little shout out because I just thought that was adorable. I, it still cracks me up that people enjoy watching me because I'm a hot mess. So uh, to hear that, it just, it, honest to God, it cracks me up. Um, it's very, very, makes me feel... Um, that when I, may, I just think maybe I give people a good laugh. <laughs> That's what I think. Because I'm crazy. So, you know, I just wanted to make sure I gave a little shout out to my little girlfriend who likes to watch me. Um, Kaylee's mom said that she wakes up in the morning and says she wants to watch Messy Jessie, which I just think is A, the cutest thing, and B, hysterical. No idea why anybody would want to watch me, but... I think in a little kiddo's eyes, they probably, you know, enjoy seeing a crazy girl. <laughs> so I just think it's absolutely adorable. Okay, so I'm trying to get all my excess off. I don't want any lines. And look at all this excess paste I'm pulling up. We just want to rub our squeegee right across it, get it right up, and stick it right back into our container because we don't want to waste any of this. Right? I see t tons of lines, Jess. Tons and tons. Okay, so we got to move quick so that way I can get this rooster on and get this rooster off as well. Because remember, I'm doing, trying to do this lift and peel method. So I don't want my chalk paste to, um, to dry on me. Okay, and then some aquamarine, get this on, okay, so now we're going to pull, lift and pull, whoa, not the chalk base, don't come with it please, oh that looks good, I, th I was a little concerned because I thought I was going to have some bubbles. Okay, but I don't, so hooray for that. And I got to get some of this on because it's not going to, I can't pull all the way back then because it's not all in the same area. That made no sense what I just said. It's not, it, meaning I won't be able to pull do a, a true pull back because I'm slacking in some areas here. There we go. Yay, nothing dried. Okay, so hold on, here's what I'm gonna do. Now we're A, gonna have to clean up a little bit on the board, which I'm not concerned about. But, hi Ken Hess, hi Michelle, hi Steph, hi Jean, hi Christina, hi Brittany, hi Raph, hi Mabel, hi Rachel. So let's go ahead and get this dried. Do not let your dryer hit your transfer. It will shrink it. I know this from experience. Now I specifically want to make sure up here is dry because I'm going to add a um, I'm going to add something up here to hold my transfer uh, up so that way I can do, finish the bottom part of this. And I love how rugged this looks. Like very rustic. It's awesome. This is lemon yellow, Heather. Hi, Nicole. Lemon yellow, aquamarine, and red is what I am using. Okay, so what we're going to do now. Oh, don't be falling over on me. Okay, hold on. Let me grab my containers. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. I've had my dryer for years. Um, I will message you the link as soon as I am done this. Um... Heather, I'll show you, send you where I got it from. My heat tool that I used in a prior life. Okay, so 
We got the yellow all the way done up to there. So now let's go ahead and finish. Now I'm a little concerned because like I said, Messy Jessie made her debut and I dropped some and didn't see that it was on there. So hopefully it doesn't, it's not completely dry um, in the spot that I dropped it and hopefully maybe I just reactivated it by going over it because if I did not, we're gonna have a little spot where it, it's gonna pull up. But honestly, because of how cool this transfer is and how, like I said, the rugged look that it has, I don't think I'm really concerned about it. Why am I using a half a squeegee to do this? Seriously, it's gonna take me nine years when I could have just used my small squeegee or my angled squeegee and called it a day by now. <laughs> it's all right, I like to learn the hard way, clearly. Okay, so this part down here is going to be a little funky because it's not pushed all the way down because of the way the board is. Oh, and I have a nice big air bubble in my E. I just saw it. Ugh. All right, so let's get all this excess paste off. No lines. God, I got a lot of excess. It's good. Okay, let's pull it off and see if it's not a crazy mess here. All right, only in the one spot. Yay! Awesome! Hi, Sabrina. Hi, Donna. Just slide parchment paper under the transfer. I actually did hear that, um, Heidi, but I did not have any readily available. So that's why I just had this stuff on my on my table and I just went with it. <laughs> I usually forget those kinds of things like Q-tips, which again, if I had a Q-tip, this would be super easy to clean up. Um, I always seem to forget that stuff. Always, always, always. Hi, Brenda. Hi, Christina. How are you guys? I'm just going to close up my piece before I clean up the, the spot that had the air bubble. And then I'll show you the full completed project. Let's get, oh, I have a stirry stick left in there. So like, look how easy that is. Like, I wish I would have started doing this pullback method a long time ago, because what I would was doing for the big ones, I would go through, do them all as quick as I possibly could. And I'd usually pull up and it was dry and then I would just replace it. Like, I totally became a pro. I'm going to toot my own horn there. I became a pro at replacing and re-chalking. Re um, but now I don't have to worry about that. Oh, yay, Heather, do it. I'll watch you. Hi, Elizabeth. Hi, Kim. Hi, Cindy. Um, so, yeah. That is going to be that. Now let's just get this cleaned up. Like I said, the spot that had the air bubble, I got to clean up. And I got some little chalk boogers. Whoopsie daisy. Not sure what that was. Some this chalk stuff up. No. No, not while it's wet. Don't. Yeah, this yellow is so vibrant. And my dining room is yellow. And I have red curtains. And, of course, I had to incorporate the aquamarine just because it's an awesome color. Hello, it's like our color. So, that was why I did that. Oh, thanks, Lourdes. Oh, thank you, Elizabeth. Yeah, definitely. Tammy, do not feel overwhelmed. Don't feel overwhelmed at all. Seriously, take you could take your time. Just do it in layers. And I don't cut my transfers. I won't cut my transfers. Um, I'm more intimidated to cut a transfer than to do this, the pulling back. I, I absolutely am. So, all right, let's do this. And also, while I'm cleaning this up, if you guys, while you were watching this, if you say, oh my goodness, I would love to purchase this. I would love to see some more, some more um, projects that you've done. I'd love to see some specials that you offer. 
um, why don't you join my VIP group? All you have to do is comment me down below. I am sorry, it is not open to designers. This is a customer group only. Um, and then if you say, you know what, I would love to try my hand at Chalk Couture, and heck, I would love to have myself a nice little discount. Um, why don't you comment join down below and I will add you to my opportunity group. Um, hi, Bob. So that, yeah, just comment join if you'd like to go into the opportunity group. You love being a chocolate tour designer. I know I absolutely love being a designer. Probably the best decision next to saying yes when my husband asked me to marry him and saying heck yes when we decided we were ready to have kiddos. <laughs> so next to those decisions, this was the best. Alrighty, so let's, I think this looks great. I'm not upset about the F cutting off. I'm totally fine with that. So let's put these both together and I'm going to show them both to you. So let's get these out of the way. So we've got farm to table. And then the second part of this, which I, I just thought it would be super cool to break it up. Um, we've got farm to table and table to soul. Gosh, this is gonna look so great. Hi, Sid, hi, Billy. I love this method this too, Nancy. So here's what I think I'm gonna do. I think I'm gonna disconnect the camera and put these two next to each other, or I'll try and lay them on top of each other on my sofa. Hold on. And then I can ugh, disconnect the camera and show you guys. These are heavy boards. Oh my God, don't knock the water over Let's see. That looks so good. Okay, hold on. Let me disconnect you guys from here. And not break my light at the same time. And there we have it. Farm to table and table to soul. Stand back a little bit more so you can see it all in. Oh, I love it. It's a, now it's obviously not crooked, it's just because of the way I had to. Um, adjust my camera but I love it that's so awesome it's gonna look so good and I'm gonna put them on top of each other like this one obviously and that one right underneath it on my wall oh that looks so good I love it okay let me bring you guys back over hopefully I'm not making you dizzy I don't have a very steady hand so Okay, so that is it for tonight. I hope you love it. Hi, Renee. Yes, it was lemon yellow. Thank you, Jen. Um, I hope you guys love this. I enjoyed this project tonight. I love sharing with you guys. Um, if you have not um, already joined my YouTube channel, um, make sure you go and subscribe because I'm going to try to be doing more YouTube lives um, over these days now. So I'm going to just stick this link in the comments below so you can find it. And that way you can go on over and subscribe to me so you'll get notifications of when I go live there now. I think that's the right website. There it goes. Um, I do too, Heather. That's what I was thinking. I'm like, you know, I have so many you know, one piece giant boards, but I was like, I'm going to make it look a little different. And I, I really, really love the separated board. I think it looks super awesome. And I can't wait to hang it up. I'm going to, well, I can't hang it up tonight because my luck, I'm going to drop them and wake the whole house up. And I don't want to do that. So, <laughs> so we'll, um, we will not do that. We will not be doing it. I will wait until tomorrow morning to hang them both up. But I think they look great, and I thank you guys so much for joining me tonight. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your Friday evening, and I will be in probably super early tomorrow morning to do another project because tomorrow we are having the family party for Little Brand for his birthday. Um, so I'll be busy cleaning and running and getting the stuff because Little Brand doesn't eat cake. You know, he has his um, feeding sensitivities. So we do water ice, so I have to run and get that. And before anybody asks and says, oh my goodness, what is water ice? Um, 
Water ice is, um, it's, I would think everybody has it. Everybody sh maybe knows what it is, but I don't know if it's kind of like an East Coast thing, um, but it's flavored ice. I know it sounds crazy and it's probably like, what is that? It's so good. It's just the way it's made. It's, it's ice and it's flavored and it's good. So <laughs> little man likes that. So I'll be doing that. So I'll be in bright and early tomorrow to do the live. Um, so if you guys don't have any other questions, I'm going to let you go and have a great night. Bye.